Carnarvon at the Aboriginal Cultural Centre and uh, thought I'd take the opportunity to show you a little bit of, about the Cultural Centre and have the opportunity to talk to Justine who's the coordinator of the Cultural Centre. So uh, uh, look, I'll show you a few things and then uh, we'll have a chat to Justine. So you can see there's quite a few artistic items that the uh, people in the cultural centre put together and uh, you can take a look at these. It's uh, quite a large building. We've been running a KLR school here in, uh, in Carnarvon. <coughs> Here's some of the things that you can, you can view that uh, have been uh, made by the local people. Um, acting manager of the Gascoigne Heritage and Cultural Centre, which is in Carnarvon in northwest WA. Uh, we've had the doors open for two weeks, and the centre is about celebrating Aboriginal heritage and culture in the Gascoigne region. Uh, the centre comprises of a small cafe, gallery cafe, we have an area for artists and residents, we have a small gallery space where we're about to create a 3D audio-visual um, experience on the region and on Aboriginal culture here in the Gascoigne. We have a large gallery which will ultimately have a permanent uh, interpretive exhibition celebrating the history of Aboriginals in this area. Um, currently we're about to have a, our first regional exhibition um, begin. And then we have to, we have, a, we have a gallery store here in the centre as well. Um, which is about promoting uh, local artists and a retail outlet for them. Uh, one of these being this basket that's made by our current artists in residence, the Jill and Bree Weavers, um, which is uh, their contemporary fibre artists, and this has been made from lemongrass. Um, so please call and visit us when you're coming through to Carnarvon. Um, I look forward to meeting you all.